A chartered plane carrying a Brazilian soccer team has crashed outside the city of Medellin. Though the team was not the Brazilian national team, it was a first division team from the city of Chapeco, which were on their way to a tournament to compete against Atletico Nacional of Medellin. They were experiencing a season that was somewhat of a fairy tale and they defeated two of Argentina's best teams. The mayor of Medellin, Federico Gutierrez, was quoted saying, What was supposed to be a celebration has turned into a tragedy. Earlier this month, the plane carried Argentina's national team for a match in Brazil. In it had also once carried the Venezuelan national team. It departed from Santa Cruz, Bolivia and crashed on a mountainside. Like a scene from a tragic film, it was pouring rain and the visibility was poor. Rescue workers by the dozens worked tirelessly through the night to rescue passengers from the wreckage. Several people were pulled out alive so their efforts seemed worth it. But as the night went on, the torrential downpour prevented rescue helicopters from seeing the crash site on the ground. Authorities had to resort to freezing the body recovery operation until dusk. The plane crash killed 76 people of the 81 that were on board. Six actually survived, but one died later from injuries in the hospital. Aviation authorities said that the plane suffered an electrical failure. The pilot declared an emergency and the plane lost all radar contact at around 10 p.m. on Monday. But one of the survivors actually said that the plane ran out of fuel around five minutes before its expected landing. All soccer activities were suspended until further notice. From all of us here at IO, our hearts go out to the victims of the families and we wish the survivors a speedy recovery.